Hi all, this is Alpha Maniac Toby. Uh, as I said you last time, we are going to explore Android Studio. I've been done the uh, in the past two videos. I have explained and I have told you to download the Android Studio. Today we are going to just uh, run our own small application in which we'll be doing some minor minor changes in our application through this studio. So let's start. So in this, we'll start it like writing like uh, we will say this is a project one so this is a good, uh, really good way you to start your project uh, so you have to start the upper case start your project with the uppercase letter project one so next we'll just start doing it for f phone and tablet and aim for gingerbread because uh, You'll, uh, you will have the 100% of devices that are active on Google Play Store. That means if I put the latest of version of Android that is Marshmallow, you'll see 4.7% people only have Marshmallow. And KitKat, 73%. Jellybean, 87%. And if you go to Honeycomb, you'll have 97%. And you go for gingerbread you'll have 100 percent of those devices which are working on which are having uh, the android thing so you'll be able to uh, know which this uh, which uh, uh, version of android your app will run on so let's go to the next video so this is a full screen act you have so many activities here we'll just start by doing an basic activity or even an empty activity or you can you can either uh, also have a full screen activity so let's start doing my full screen activity you it's your wish you can choose anything um, because I have chosen gingerbread you can't do a full screen activity so I'm doing an empty activity <coughs> so let's start it by naming uh, main activity and let's finish it your gradle will be running on so it will be creating the project so until then I'll tell you guys for thank you for the support you have been giving me you have given me 31 subscribers and it's really good to see that people you people have been uh, liking my videos and sharing it i have got 104 views not even my gaming channel gaming videos have those many views but thank you guys for this what you have been giving me so let's get straight into our android studio project i hope you guys follow this project all the way till the end um, because this will be really fun and this will be really great so now as you can see my uh, this has been loaded and it's really good to see that it's been loaded so fast uh, let's see how our configuration and our component trees are working I'll explain you I'll explain that how this works and all so let's just uh, close this gradle and all okay component tree and we have design and text so this will be rendering and all so do not worry about this guys it will do every task for you easily and you have so many things here you have uh, layouts buttons checkbox radio buttons spinners rating bar etc you just have to do is drag and click and then you have to conf configure that how it works so my thing doesn't have a digital clock you will get a dash because I haven't loaded that still now <coughs> see this is the text which I have been uh, having and now we are going to do some small small changes to what we are going to do this ok it's rendering mm, I think we don't need this we will just view how to do this here ok rendering problems because uh, this fix build and etc try to build the project ok thanks uh, we will do that later okay see android action bar layout etc etc let's go and see the text view of this and if i am seeing the text view i will obviously get uh, the other view also if i am doing it see project one hello world it is now loaded fully loaded and now let's start doing some small small changes to this so here you can see that the changes are nothing but uh, 
layout height width padding and top so let's start uh, by doing this known as you have what all relative layout and text view see this is where it starts and ends relative layout and etc so what I'm gonna do basically is I'm gonna load this down till here I'm gonna open the projector uh, this is so small we'll do it like this basically and the text view so let's start by saying this hello world we'll stay that as hello world is not good hey this this is my first project okay we have this is my is not this is my first project and you can also put uh, happy k rest okay okay some things haven't loaded now uh, but uh, afterwards it will uh, start loading and it is still rendering see this is my first project now what we do is inside this we will put another space 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 back android is to text so writing down here android is to text is is equal to like you know you're saying the android please write down the test text which I am uh, writing down for you you're giving the uh, you're giving it a command so I see okay so we'll put it control C and backspace that and here text oh no 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 see guys you have so many if you get it wrong it will be put in uh, the space so control V enter text android text is equal to why is this wrong because remove attribute text etc etc so don't worry about that because I put uh, a small so now let's put is equal to over that equals to sorry <laughs> equals double dash we'll put this and we'll put uh, hi all oops uh, so this is what uh, it will show up in this and it's still in rent I don't know why uh, okay so if you think this is not good we will cut this out let's put uh, the text color of this Android Android oops R O I D is to oops is to T E X T oops X T and now you have all caps appearance color color hint uh, link and direction edit paste etc etc we'll put android color for this android is to text color so now backspace of this i got it equals so for this you'll get a hint box and you have to put uh, it like the color of this will be let's start with hashtag zero or hashtag f f f f so this will be white 
see here the color has come up it is known as it is the color this uh, command uh, this rep uh, represents the color of this so let's see hashtag fffff means it is the white color you have so many things for uh, this color you'll have ffa3c you can just look it out here in this uh, small box see it's so helpful and you can also put out which color you want uh, let's start by putting it on a dark black color <laughs> So you can see here it is the dark black color um, of FF0000 is uh, dark black. So let's put it in another way. So I've chosen this. So now it is in black color. So now we will see this in design. It is uh, rendering and this is dark black. Now you can put it even in the red color also. So you can change colors and you can do everything here. Choose this and let's go to the design view of this so this is my first project is now it is in red so you can change how you want this android text size android is to text see now you have our text style and text size so you put text size for this double click over that and you will put it as what is this missing value ok let's put it uh, 20 let's put it 20 22 ok what is the let's put it as yes so it is giving me a hint for uh, so you should have pixels for that uh, avoid using px and use dp instead so see here you have the dp element so now you can even put dp for this dp which is same like uh, pixels so let's see how much big is 111 pixels for 111 dp for this you should do sp instead of dp for text sizes okay that's a good hint we will uh, carry it out now sp thanks so now let's see the design for this hey this is my first project this is really big isn't it okay so now let's go and put just uh, so it's so big now let's put 19 for this 19 pixels 19 sp and let's see the design for this that's good now we'll see that we have got a table for this this table was accidentally made up so if to remove this you just have to drag it outside or delete hey this is my first project now let's go to the text and add another text so this is done easily by putting the small command known as put up uh, the, the less than symbol and put up a text view <coughs> note that uh, the text and etc should be the T should be caps and note for caps and etc caps and small letters because uh, they vary a lot in these type of this and let's put it enter okay android layout etc support widget uh, auto component text view so we got the text view for ourselves itself layout width uh, let's put the layout width as um, match parent because we don't know what is going to do happen for this okay sorry <laughs> double click on whenever uh, m a c t h match oh m a t c h match parent and this is also gonna match parent for this so now we've got our own text view support widget and now let's go and put up enter again so here we'll start off by writing our t e x t oops t 
e x t v i e w so this is our text view which starts up okay so the layout with okay so this was mistakenly he i put it up uh, so now let's see the layout with should be always wrap content because you are going to uh, put it around our uh, wrap small this and content okay i put it wrong i put it warp instead of wrap so it is correct now oops so i'm a little bit slow in this so don't worry guys i'll be fast whenever you want but when you're going to try this always be always try to explore things more than more and uh, you'll get to know more about coding and programming in these type of things put us enter and let's see we'll put another android text android text oops is to t e x t text is equal to let's say uh we'll put it like a design hey this is my first project and in this middle we'll put up uh okay guys i have to tell you not only writing works you can just cut this out and let's go to the design if you want it to be more easy you can just do it plain text view drag it out here you where you want to keep it and i'll let it keep here you know i'll extend this a little bit so that uh, i can see it more oops hopefully you have a good thing so that uh, okay now let's put a large text here because we want it to be large okay you can put directly text over here like uh, press to next page over here press to next page is up here in the text view you will get c in the text view you got it like press to next page so now you can uh, put another put another command for this saying that i want the android is to t e x t c o l o r is equal to i want it to be green so it will be more helpful for you know in the in the white page so android text color is equal to let's put uh, so normally you don't know what color what come what uh, symbol or whatever what is the configuration for the color so don't worry guys you can put the normally you learn that, that learn that it is f hash 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 i mean sorry hash ff so that is where you get uh, the normal white color so when you get the normal white color you could just go directly over here and put it out whatever color you want so i want it to be green i want it to be dark green now obviously so choose this and it will automatically configure itself into uh, <coughs> the color so don't worry about uh, i don't know the color some color uh, configuration you could just put it there and i want the text size android text size oops android is to text size is equal to so you know you have to put the text size in sp i'm going to put it uh, like 3 1 sp okay so now let's see how our design is yes so the color has not come up so now what we'll do is we'll put another button here 
so we can drag and put the button so there is there you go it is the new button over there and then now in text you will see that you have the button over here so what you do is you can even change the buttons name like c l i c k m e click me and and more so let's see that we have our uh, everything over here okay guys let's go to the design see it is now click me so now if you click this nothing will happen i will teach you how to put this to the next page in the next video uh, maybe so th in the next video i'll be teaching you the basic calculator or basic how to add things using uh, this uh, android studio thank you guys for all the support please do consider cl uh, clicking the subscribe button if this is the first video you're watching from my side um, please do like and comment on what what uh, you want to hear from me thank you guys until then goodbye